news, we have Jimmy back. Jimmy is, is off of the injured reserve, and now he's ready to go kill some... All right, Jimmy. I want you to run over here. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Jimmy's dead. Hey, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Open XCOM. So to begin with, uh, how are we going to come back from this? I think our days of... The, uh, the rifles uh, are, are over. Um, I'm picking up a couple of them. I have to restock everything, of course, because we had that explosion. We still got all of our gear. Um, I'm picking up a couple of them. These are basically going to be base defense weapons. I'm just going to have them laying around. But from now on, we're going to become a high-explosive squad, I think is the only way. Uh, as far as we are in the game, we're facing mutons and chrysalids. I think we're going to have to go with something bigger than rifles. Rifles aren't cutting it anymore. And until we get new tech... We're stuck with this. So, what we're doing is pick up some auto cannons, heavy cannons, and rocket launchers. Um, it's going to be our most of our stuff will be that. Um, I think probably what I'm going to have to start doing is most of the crew will be sniping with things like like uh, um, rockets, heavy rockets, and uh, auto cannons. I'll have a few folks with the auto cannons with the uh, AP ammo, AP ammo, and uh, the uh, auto cannons as well. I got 10 of those still. Um, but pretty much everyone else is going to have high explosives. We're going to grab more high explosive grenades and a few stun rods. So I think that is going to be the plan going on. I'm going to hold off on the tank for now. But that is that is the plan. Uh, you may notice I, I do have a new uh, sounds. I have, I've uh, downloaded a new music sound and also sounds for the game. So let's see how it, how it goes. I'm not sure how I feel about it yet, but we'll we'll try it out and see how it goes. Anyways, though, we were heading back from... Uh, there's four of us, anyways, heading back from <laughs> from the Crystalline Spot. At least on the bright side, we stopped a terror site. So that's something. Um, I have renamed a few. I don't, I'm out of other soldiers, but I've got... Uh, from Mr. Badger on down, we have Fenur the Eighth. Oh, it hurts. Oh, man, Fenur. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Fenur. I've, so many Fenurs have been strewn about the world. It's rough. Rough if you're a Fenur, anyway. <laughs> anyways. Uh, okay, there's all our gear. We'll equip the Sky Ranger before too long, before our next mission. Uh, you know what I need to do? Oh, we have the ally shotgun. Oh, it looks cool. Armor piercing. That's damage. 60 times 5. We must have been able to apply the alien metals to a shotgun design, using Illyrium to power alloy rounds for increased penetration. So that's 60 times. How much is something like... So we got for that one. Uh, where's something like that we used, we're used to? It's way better than the regular shotgun. But much better than the sniper rifle. The rifle's only 30, so it's twice as good as the rifle. But it is five shots. Does that mean if I'm, like, point blank and all five hit, does that mean it's 65 times? I think so. That is nice. Okay, so remember all that talk about I had about our gear. I think what the plan we're going to do, I think now, I think we'll start giving those to our Breach the craft, folks. So we'll have the, the large rockets sitting in the back on the on the mountains, and the heavy the heavy cannons, and we'll have a few folks with those alloy shotguns and send them in. So now, what is next to research? Now we have pretty much. I think we've gotten everything done, haven't we? I know we got an engineer. We haven't done the cyber disc yet. We can see what it tells us. Yes, we are going to make these. Um, we really need the power suits. But we're going to put a few of them on the uh, shotgun. Everybody. And let's make, make a dozen. And then we'll start working on some ammo. 92 days. What's this other base working on? Pacific, what are you working on? We're going to power suits as well. And one day you'll be done. Uh, I may have you... What should I do with this? Maybe I should have them. They are all power suit. And then... No, 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 no. You are going to be... Shotgun. And... Uh, ammo. What does it require? Requires two alien alloys to make the ammo. Okay. And we'll make a bunch of those. That's good. Okay, yeah, once we're done with that ammo, we can put them over to the shotgun. Shotguns take a long time to make. 
I have room in this? I do have some workshop space available. Let's buy a couple engineers. We'll do 12. They'll give us an even... Even 40. This is kind of cool. I kind of like it. Uh, we got some more folks. We'll get some the rest of you guys named. Who don't, who don't I have? There's a few folks I don't have. Okay, we want more power suits. Oh, I don't have enough stuff for it. Okay, I gotta move that over. We need more engineers over here. Don't we? We have living quarters for it. Yeah. Need more engineers. I've been holding off making them because I don't have any things. I, mean, I do have things to make now, so I might as well grab them. I'll grab 30 more. We can do that. Uh, okay. And we need to transfer over. Actually, I'm going to let Northstar do it. Transfer to Pac Man. Pac Pacific. I'll call it Pac Man in my Terror from the Deep game. <laughs> um, they can have. Where, where are we at? Where are we at? Did I move it all already? might have. I don't... Yeah, I guess I did. We have a lot of Illyrium. They can have... We'll do 100 more. That gives us 20 power suits. And we're going through these power suits entirely too fast. And what was the... Alien Alloys. Store space. We'll transfer that for now. Back to Osiris. They can have all these power suits. Anything else they can have? So I probably should be doing this off camera. That probably would be easier on you. Uh, where is my. Where they are? Where they are? Yeah. 60? Oh, I need 70. There we go. Power suits take up a lot of space, I guess. Okay, so let's continue. Okay, they are now there, so the Pacific is going to manufacture power suits. Like there. And we're going to do 20 of them. Hopefully this will be the last 20 we make. You never know. Maybe we'll learn how to how to not die. You never know. <laughs> oh, that's right, end of the month. Uh, everybody loves us. And... Um, we're still doing really good. Excellent. 4,200. That's a good rating. Yeah, everyone is happy. General Force of Osiris is good. Good. We have some engineers now at Osiris. They're going to work on the shotgun. 46 days is a little more reasonable. We have a small one over here in North America. So the North American. We'll go grab that guy. What are you? This sound. Oh, the, the rocket firing sounds really cool. I'm not sure about this, the music of that one, though. Uh, okay, as soon as daytime hits, we will get the... We're going to call this the Muton Slaying Crew. That's what these guys do. Is they take out Mutons. I never transferred anything good over here, still. Let's see, do we have gear for them? Uh, we still have some rockets. We have six rockets. That's something. But okay, I'm going to equip this, and then we will go get it. One second. Alright, everyone's here. And big news, we have Jimmy back. Jimmy is, is off of the injured reserve. And now he's ready to go kill some... Maybe mutons, actually. Did I give him armor? Uh, I may not have... Armor. Jimmy, you didn't get... Oh, I don't have the armor for Jimmy. Uh, here. There you go. Have some of that. Okay. So let's go get them. I'm expecting mutons again. Oh. in the Pacific. I should try this one. And shoot. What, so we got, what we got? Large scout. The rocket's shooting. Sounds pretty cool. I'll give it that. The music is a little... I don't know. It's almost... Oh, I'm out of ammo now. Uh, we can... Give me... I have one in Fiji I can send out. I'll 
probably grab this one before. Oh, I never send it out. Ah! Oh, wait, you can't do anything. I'll leave him alone. Okay, let's go send out this Sky Ranger. Uh, North Star, there you go. We do have the tank. We have only two rocket carriers. So, I'm hoping it's not mutons. I always hope it's not mutons. But we'll see. Because right, this one... Oh, there is something in there. Um, who wants it? I give it to... Zombie needs to get it. There. And there you go. Okay. Alright, let's see what we got. We're going to prime this. And we'll toss it out. Right about at that stump there. And then Jimmy. Throw it. I gotta get some gear at this base. I keep forgetting to restock this base. So they're pretty poorly equipped. Oh, that's not cool. Alright, let's go scout. We see nothing over there. There's the front door. Hmm. Alright. Alright, Jimmy. I want you to run over here. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Jimmy's dead. Jimmy just got back. Jimmy's dead already. We can't see anything because we smoked ourselves in. Alright. Uh, oh, you don't need that. You have an alien grenade, which may be useful. I'm going to run you over here, though. And then... Well, maybe we can get a grenade relay it over to someone else that's going to hide up behind this tree. Like Swampus. That doesn't seem safe. Let's go this way. So we know there's bad news over there. I'll leave you up here. Stand your ground in the ship. Hingle. Can you get up? Yeah. Something may come out of that door, so shoot it with your zero time units. Uh, zombies are going to stay in the ship, too. We're going to move our snipers back this way. And Hattie. All these weapons. These weapons are terrible. Oh, last one. Our, uh, our sergeant on the crew. Uh, come on. Can you live here? Yeah. There we go. And then last one, we're going to move the zombie to right here. I still can't see that guy. Oh, man. How did you, what? How did you get that shot? There you go. That's right, zombie. Oh, that was... Oh, man. Um, alright. Grass Tyson is dead. Yeah, we lose two already. To snake men. All right, come out of here. Does he have a grenade? Oh, oh, oh! He's not even looking at us. Okay. Have a grenade. Have a grenade. No. Um, just get back here. Take a. Don't take a knee. Uh, can you see from here? There's a Sky Ranger in the way. How about? There and then give me a uh, snapshot. It's terrible with these things. Nope. Look. How about a snap from there. Four percent. Um. Zombie. Can you from there hit him without hitting the Sky Ranger? I'd like to take the aim shot. No. But you can step out and do a snap. You need to take a knee. There you go. Close enough. Um, I'm going to move you up here with this sniper, I think. And this crew. I'm hosing myself here because this crew is horribly under-equipped. Okay, you do that. And anyone else? Uh, Hingle. I should give you some cover. Actually, you know what? Actually, go over here. Oh! Um, I didn't move my tank. Why didn't I move my tank? Uh, aim shot. Take him out. Wow, where is that going? I still have you. Can give me a snap. Where? 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 Alright. Let's tank have it. 
Oh, that was it. Okay, there was three aliens, and I lost two. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, we got some captains. Captain McCrinkle and Scorch. Nice. Okay, uh, before we do that, I have to equip this base. Cause, um, actually, I'll do this off camera. So hold on one second. Okay, so we got a lot of stuff. Um, I'm going, I need to buy some more storage space, though. So we're going to buy some stores in here. Uh, build for, uh, we need general stores. Once we get those in, we can... Oh, we don't need any more stuff, really, but just to give us some room. Okay, so I'm trying to take this thing out. I don't want it over water, though. I need it over land. There we go. Uh, oh, it landed. Um, do I want to take a night mission? I think I do. This one's not equipped. We could equip the main base and go get that one. Let's do that. It may not be landed anymore. Who knows? Those other ones that were in Japan were landed. What's the deal with Japan and staying land? I don't know. Uh, anyways, uh, I'll equip. One second. Alright, we're ready to go. Uh, I also got some names in there because we have a new soldier. Uh, even after what just happened last time, we have a new soldier. DFYE has joined us. And uh, welcome aboard. You were first one off the craft. I hope you uh, enjoy your time here. So, anyways, we're going to send off our Sky Ranger here to Japan, which is something going down here in Japan. I don't know what's happening, but something. Oh, it might actually be daytime. Um, I don't know if they're sitting there, and it will be daytime. Check that out. Only mostly daytime. Prime that, and you prime that one. All right. Uh, it's it's not daytime apparently. I guess I didn't. <laughs> I thought it was daytime. I guess I wasn't quite past the line. Where are we at here? Uh, here's a corner over here. So let's throw it there. And then, I want you to throw yours... How about you throw yours there? There you go. Uh, we need to pick out some flares. Everyone's going to grab a flare on their way out. Let's see what we have here. This is UFO, UFO doors, by the way. They sound a little different now. Alright, first one out. We can see nothing. So we're going to throw it up here on this hill. I'm going to take a knee and throw it up on that hill. There you go. Okay, it is very dark. Watercress. Put that in here. Grab yourself a flare. And let's head out here. And this is the corner, right? Yeah. I can't move anymore. Have I done a night mission? Other than... I think I did a terror site. That was night. But other than that, I don't know that I have. I can't remember. Alright, Hobbs, grab yourself a flare. I've been avoiding them as much as I can. Because I'm scared. Hobbs gonna go here and... Oh. Man, so many of my soldiers that were such high rank... I said it last time, too. Are dead. And then they died, they died again. As if dying once wasn't enough. They're very dead. Uh, Silencer, I'm going to run you this way. And Hellraiser can... I might use this hill as a sniping spot, so we're over here. What was this? This was a, a large scout. And it's landed, so there'll be a little over half a dozen folks on this one. Oh! There's one. Nobody has time to shoot it, though. Oh, you do. With a sniper rifle. Oh! There's two of them. Um, you need 23 to shoot. Can you... You won't be able to... Maybe there. We can try it. Nice shot, Mr. Badger. Pro check out the time. 69 time units on this guy. Pro Baru, you're all right. Uh, we're going to run you over here because we're going to get you up on, the, on uh, I think, this little hill here. It's not even big enough to be considered a hill. Maybe a, a hillock, that would be the word. 
And uh, Tengu is, is quite the soldier, too. I don't know how many time units he has. There is a mod I've been looking at, Colonel Davis. Um, that it's called a Soldier Diaries, and you can it gives out medals based on certain accomplishments and things. I think it might work with the mod now. I'm going to try it out and see if it does. If it does, that would be cool. I have sort of a side recognition thing kind of going on. I think it would be cool. So I may check that out next time. Oh! My face! Whose face was that? Little girl dwarf. She's okay. She's been shot in the face before. Uh, who wants to scout? Oh, new guy! Of course. Where's the? Where's all my flares? I cannot see my flares. There's one up here. Um, does anyone else have one? Dark Angel has one. Can you throw this a decent ways? No. There we go. Nice shot. Uh, I'm not gonna have you shoot at it, but um, yeah, go ahead. He shot you in the face, little girl dwarf. Your accuracy is terrible. Fifty-six. That's not. That's better. And now there's a hill in the way. All right, forty-nine percent. There's still a hill in the way, apparently. Uh, Tango, can you hit him? No. Uh, all right. Do you have a grenade? Anybody have a grenade? Oh, here we can do this. You can hit him. Whoa! Where is that? Where? It... <laughs> this gun's terribly inaccurate. Dark Angel, how about you with a snapshot? I need, to, I need to fix your weight. You are way overburdened. Uh, watergrass? Maybe? Ah, there we go. And he's unconscious. Good job. Okay, Voyager, let's... Run this way. In fact, grab this flare. Is that where it is? Is it one more? One more. Pick up that flare next turn. Um, I would like to get a flare this way. There we go. Okay, move silencer up on the hill. You can do something like that. And then I'm going to let Soup Carrier join you. Private Soup Carrier is a private again. Sadly. I'm going to move everyone up a bit slowly here since it is nighttime and we can't see a dang thing. Colonel goes out in front, of course. Badger will do that. Um, where's the rest of my flares? Who else has them? You have one that you can probably throw to him. Yeah, you can kind of throw to him. I don't have time to throw it now. So he's taking me. Tengu. Um, I'm not going to go over that hill just yet. Anyone else? Oh, Hellraiser. Where was he? Hobbs, too. Hellraiser. I'm going to move you over here. We're going to go on this hill soon. Uh, Hobbs. I'll put you this way. Anyone else? Yep, that's good. So we got, what, three down? Can you run there and throw it still? Well, there is the craft. Throw. Nice. So, I want... Uh, I think I want Hellraiser up here. Whoa! Whoa! Um... Just take a knee. You're fine up there. If we can get... We know where it came from. He's right here. So if we can get a grenade over there. Somebody has a grenade, right? Somebody... These soldiers are so weak. A lot of them don't have grenades. We could try to let Fener do something. Fener the Eighth... Uh, no. Let's just throw one against the wall here. Nice! Oh, we got two more! Mr. Badger! Look at you! Man! Yeah, I gotta get that, that, that medals mod so I can start awarding people like Mr. Badger for their heroic deeds. 
trees in the way. There's a lot of maps still over here. Uh, let's go find some trees to hang out behind. And uh, let's just kind of slowly move everyone up. Proberu, I'm going to run. You need to run? You don't need to run. Just head up to behind that tree. That tree looks sturdy. And I don't know if this is the front door or not, but we're going to pretend that it is for now until we can know, know any different. Uh, it's not, so we're going to stop pretending. All right, watercress. I'm going to put you up. I'll get you on that hill shortly. And then the two rockets. Dwarf can go there. And Tengu can go up here. You guys should be able to pretty much see the world from up there. And Dark Angel's left. Dark Angel is overburdened pretty heavily. So he's not moving anywhere fast. Um, I'm here with you guys. You guys are good there. You can see the, the side of the crafting. We just can't see the door. Oh! That's my new guy. Took it like a man. Oh, it didn't even hurt. Alright, we gotta find where that came from. Um, go figure out where that came from. You pick this up and throw it over there. We got a billion rockets behind you. You're alright. We don't see him. We know it came from over here. Who wants to scout? Hobbs, can you make it to... You can't. Bad place to stop. Bad place to stop. Well, we know we could just try shooting. Hit this tree. What? What? Things blow up in... Did we hit the Illyrium or something? I don't know what just happened. Uh, but we blew up our flare, that's for sure. Oh! Oh! Hurts. Oh, Dark Angel is bleeding. Oh, let's get him right here. Right here. More blind shots. Let's do it. Tengu. Hit something. Two of them? What? <laughs> Alright. This is how you play XCOM. You don't just do one. <laughs> okay, you do that. Um, Davis, you have a flare and you're going to use it because you're going to throw it right up here. There's a trees over here. Space Waiter, go, go join your colonel. And I'm still happy with you guys being here. I think this is the best place. Maybe not soup carrier. What ammo do you have? You have explosive. Um... Yeah, I'm going to throw you in Super Carrier. Need the rocket back here. We have plenty of rockets back here, I think. Mr. Badger isn't happy about the uh, double kill. There, that was his. Under that tree stump. And anyone else? No. Nope. Lots of doors still. Alright, Dark Angel, see if you can... Scout out over here. I should have loaded up the incendiary. I have incendiary ammo in the craft. And I didn't do it. I have it for this very purpose. So I don't have to deal with flares all the time. I can just shoot some incendiary stuff around. And Peru. There's got to be something standing there. I mean, he could be using the doors inside the ship, but... I don't buy it. I think they're going to be outside. Is it corner clear? Yeah. Okay. Head up here. Um, I am going to move silencer. Oh, there's a door right there. Okay. Uh, we want to get on this hill. So we're going to move everyone that way. Everyone looking at the door, and then our, our breaching folks will make their way in. Uh, like watercress. Watercress, and I think Proberu is going to stay out, but he'll get behind this tree. And Dark Angel's already over there. We're going to let... We need to get 
do you need healed? I only got five turns to live. Who has a medikit over here? Anybody? Dwarf? No. Tengu has one. Where's Tengu? Tengu! There you go. You got a job. Uh, you already spent his time. Right over there. I'll come to you next turn. And Hellraiser, I'm going to grab this and throw it and give us a little sight. Uh, put it there. Okay. Um, you go that way. How are you feeling? Yeah. Come on in. Uh, maybe. Sniper rifle. Maybe not. Okay. Alright, Hobbs, let's take a look. Oh, nothing's there. Alright. So now I'm using this... Uh, that's not a good place to stand. Well. I'm using this high explosive ammo. Which, normally, I wouldn't do inside here. But, I have power armor. And so, most likely, I will be able... It won't hurt me. I mean, rockets will hurt. But things like the uh, high explosive... Uh, heavy cannons will do nothing to me. So, that's okay. And super carrier. We'll be far enough away anyways, so it won't hurt us. We're at 30 minutes, but I'm going to go ahead and continue this and finish this out. No point in cutting this one in half. In fact, I think this we have plenty of people over here. All right, Hobbs, take a look. Uh, let's do this sidestep thing. Got nothing yet. Watercress, you're good. You can go. Just go to there. And do you have anything other than... You do have a grenade. Oh, perfect. Get in there. Do that. And then Zavis is going to check out the rest of this corner. I think it's clear. Let's get Ducky to peel up before we go. Tengu will patch him up. There you go. Okay. Um, anyone else want to go in? Space Voyager, get in there. We'll send four in, that'll be fine. And I think everyone else is done. Maybe Soup Carrier. We'll send him in just in case like bad things happen. Oh, that's the wrong button. No. Alright, let's go. Nothing there yet. We'll just get into position to move in next turn. I'm going to go ahead and grab this grenade out. Because we'll probably use it. We, wanna, we don't want to blow up the Illyrium. But, um, we'll find one of the, uh, there's some of those like, rooms that are like lounges or something that we can throw it in. Finish checking out this corner. Just to make sure there's no one standing in the corner there. And actually, you have a stun rod. I'm going to put you in there. Anyone in here have a stun rod? That would be nice. No. Very low on stun rods. So somehow we blew that up when we shot that. Interesting. Oh, yeah, you missed. There you go. Uh, let's go hang out behind this in there. Okay. And let's go here. Over there. Uh, Zavis, grab your stun rod. Zavis is pretty well weighed down. He's got a lot of... He has a lot of uh, strength. Oh, no energy, though. Oh! Man, you got shot twice? Man, welcome to the team. Alright, uh, auto shot. Forgot it was high explosive. <laughs> How's everyone feeling about that? I know you're already hurting. Ah, oh, you're okay. It's nothing. Uh, Watercrest, go in there and check it out. Apparently, that's not the last one. There's one right there. Get, uh, don't hit the Illyrium. You hit the wall. Alright, that's something. Do you have explosive? Yeah. Oh, you have one of these. Okay. 
might come out and start shooting. In fact, I'm pretty sure he will. Um, take a sidestep, Hobbs. You might be able to get a reaction shot when he comes out. It'll hurt. Shoot him! No! Hobbs, shoot! Oh, nice! Oh! Oh, man. Man. Iron Man! <laughs> um, Alright, get in. Get in there. Get him. Get him. There's still another one. I was hoping to not lose anybody here, but we did. Uh, how do you feel? Oh, you're looking at one? Oh, you're fine. Get right over here. Man, if this, is a, this isn't initiation for XCOM, I don't know what is. Uh, Alright. There he is. Somebody shoot the guy. Oh, Hobbs is dead. No, no. And just mowed me down. What is he carrying? Oh man, this turned bad. All right, you go there. We'll go wait one turn. Man, they were super carrier whenever I just in case things go bad. Yeah, that's why you're here. All right. Somebody shoot the guy. Our reactions are not good. Man, that was unpleasant. Uh, we got 11 of them. Captured two, 13 things on there. Alright. Alright. Well, wait, I didn't get any Illyrium? Why? Oh, maybe Power Source? I don't know. We have too many live aliens. What did we get? We got two navigators out of that. Um, do I need to get rid of the cultist? Do I have any soldiers? I don't want to get rid of the muton yet. Alright, well done. The two that we just grabbed. We have Colonel Tengu, Captain Pro Brew, Sergeant Badger, he deserves that. Alright, that's the end of the episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.